Hold on, I need to get into character. I got that. But what about boom operators? Boom operators deserve some love too. Often underestimated how hard it is to actually operate a boom on your body. So we created the ExoBoom. This is a whole new system that after the Ergorig has been so popular with camera operator, we've taken the same idea or a similar idea to make a versatile system for our sound brethren. Eli is a union boom operator. This is the part where Eli pays attention to me and not to Adam, crosses frame and is gonna show us how easy it is to put the exo boom on. Whoosh. Turn a little bit so we can see what you're doing. Just simply slides the buckle in. So simple to put it on. A click and a Tighten it down. Tighten it down. Oh my goodness. All right. How's that feel on you? Oh, it's nice and comfortable. I've worn this thing already for several hours, both on stage. Next step is we take our boom mast. We take the boom mast, slide it in and give a little twist here. Keeps the boom mast from spinning in the holder. The vest is built ambidextrous so that no matter whether you boom right or left-handed, no matter what situation you get into on stage, whether you're crammed into a corner and you have to work a particular way, all you do, you release it, pop it out, Slide it in on the other side, and you're good to go. Me personally, I prefer it on this side. I'm right-handed. All right. And we grab our fishbowl. Which For those of you playing at home, professionals call the boom a fishbowl. He's not actually going to be going fishing. Let's continue. <laughs> So we grab our fish pole, which has already been fitted with the squid clamps from Cinema Devices. Very simple. They open wide and they have foam on the back to keep them quiet when they interact with the other parts. You take this and you put it in with the quick release. You add the counter weight, the counter tension. Turn, turn, counterclockwise, great. Okay. And you take your rubber tubing, you slide it in right down here, and it locks in. And that gives you hands free counterbalance. Now my boom is staying up, and I'm merely guiding it with my other hand. Right. Now, I'd love to see boom operators do what he's doing now. Boom and mic themselves at the same time. Let's continue with the show already in progress. <laughs> so this now has taken the weight off of my arms. The mast is holding the fish pole in the air, and I'm able to actually boom, swing around, and focus on miking the talent more than worrying about my arms shaking from holding this thing in the air for those extra long takes that we now do in the digital world. How long have you been boom operating? I've been a union operator for over 10 years now. I'm currently working on two different network sitcoms and I've had the ability to bring this out on location with us as well as use it in a studio setting. It is extremely versatile, it is very helpful, and when you're 
directors are always doing long takes to get the best from their actors. They're not thinking about camera operators or boom operators, they're focused on the talent. So it's our job to focus on our own safety. The exo boom is going to save my back for a long career of fishpole operating. Boom operators, it's not your job to put your chiropractor's kids through college. <laughs> All right. So let's see. So right now we're pretty shrunk down. Oh, yeah. Not necessarily a real life situation. Nope. Uh, I'd love to see that later. But let me ask you this. Sure, you're a boom operator on a set. You only have to boom. What if you actually had to mix and boom at the same time? Say on location in a reality situation. Is that a possibility? The exo boom is designed for ENG operators, one man band sound team, where you've got to carry your bag with you. You take these clips, you bring them forward. You take these two posts, Screw them in real quick. That's one post. There's. For those of you playing at home, he just screwed in both sides and in notice seconds. That while I'm doing this, the fish pole is still up. I took my hands off of it and it didn't drop. It's still up in the air. It didn't clock anybody in the head, didn't hit any talent. And you take your mixing bag and you set it on the post. The posts and the vest are actually holding the bag. All these clips are for is to make sure that when you're moving around, you don't actually have it tumble off of you. But unlike other rigs, the weight of it is not being held by these clips. These are merely safety clips. I don't feel the bag pulling me forward. The whole thing is actually sitting here and there's no tension on the clips. So the weight is evenly distributed onto your body with the rest of the rig, and now I've got my bag on as well. So what you're saying is it's the weight is not on your shoulders as, as it is on many rigs that I see on sound guns. That's correct. Right now, I'm wearing this, and I'm aware that I am wearing it, but I am not feeling it pulling me down. I am not feeling it try to push me forward to counterbalance the weight. I don't have to lean back just to keep the weight of the bag from pulling me to stumble forward. No, it would be cool. What would be cool is if we can extend that. So far, not bad, More huh? Mechanical advantage there. Yep. You're like, I'm glad I clicked on this YouTube video. As you extend, walk backward. Point it at me so that you can hear what I'm saying. It's All almost right. like he's done sound before. It's as if I've done sound before. So I've got my bag on, fish pulls up in the air. All of a sudden, my talent starts stepping back. It's still holding it. I'm merely letting it rest in the crux of my thumb here. I loosen it up, and all of a sudden, here we start going. Back up some more. Yep. Okay, yep. Three, two, one, action. Boom, there it is. The cool thing about the exo boom is it's super easy on the operator's body, even with a really long boom. Right now, he's 20 feet out has literally 
a hand. He could have just a couple of fingers on the boom pole. It's not going anywhere. The fatigue he's gonna have is nominal compared to what it would be on a normal set, trying to muscle it all day long. Now I wanna say special shout out to Boom Ops because they make it look easy. It's one of the most strenuous things on your body, uh, one of the most strenuous jobs on set on your body. This extends careers, avoids injury, and won the 2022 Hollywood Sound Expo Most Useful Product. I loved it. Is there anything we're missing? You covered a lot of it. I don't think so. I mean, you got it. You got what you I mean, needed. you were fucking great. All right.